The West Indies must adapt quickly in New Zealand or risk falling behind in the series, the words of Roland Butcher, the first black cricketer to play for England. In an exclusive interview with CNC3 Sports today, the Barbadian warned West Indies fans it will take a very long time for the regional side to rise in the rankings again. He also talked Nicholas Puran and the Black Lives Matter movement. It's been almost four decades since Roland Butcher became the first black cricketer to play for England. He watched the powerhouse West Indies of his era pummel world cricket. These days, that script has flipped. The Barbadian watches as West Indies cricket struggles series after series. I don't subscribe to the fact that there will be a quick turnaround and suddenly West Indies will go from eight to two. Uh, that's not going to happen. In an interview with Guardian Media Sports from his hometown in Barbados, Butcher painted a picture of reality for West Indies fans. In addition to home advantage, he said the Kiwis will be hungry having been off the field for a lengthy period, and adaptability will be key for the West Indies. And they have to go through this quarantine period, then they have to try to acclimatize to the environment, to the pitches, to the weather, uh, very, very quickly before and during those two test matches. Those two test matches will come very quickly. So really how quickly they adapt to all of those things will really tell you how the series will go. Butcher also added his voice to the ongoing debate of whether Nicholas Puran should be given a test chance. I'm an advocate for Puran playing test cricket, providing he plays four-day cricket and performs at four-day cricket. I'm not an advocate for putting him straight in the test side based on the fact that he is done well in T20. On the backdrop of a year which saw cricket confront racial justice around the world, Butcher, who broke barriers becoming the first black cricketer to represent England back in 1981, said it must be a global fight and not just the West Indies. When I say cricket, I'm talking cricket on a global scale. It cannot be only series where West Indies are involved that the Black Lives Matter matter. Four decades after Butcher broke barriers, this generation of West Indies cricketers faces their own hurdles.